Good morning, everyone. Today we are discussing about uh, uh, web transaction logs, which is quite important for putting marks question. So when we are going to look forward into the amount of uh, web transaction. Completely, it is a base of uh, uh, your electronic activities with the help of internet. So, when you are going to use one of the internet, absolutely that internet is being accessed and used by many of uh, its own customers. Okay, you are going to assume such like, uh, uh, sir, uh, I was using uh, uh, one of the website, uh, name to be called uh, um, some of the uh, particular Cisco WebEx uh, uh, analytics. So here, do you think so that uh, the transaction is taking place only it is being restricted to that uh, WebEx analytics? Maybe this is being used by Google, this is being used by some other uh, analytics also. Okay, maybe even Facebook also may use this. Maybe some of the uh, vendor may use this for e-tailing. In the sense, electronic retailing, correct? So it is almost such like uh, where web transaction logs are having the accessibility to the website users, website owners, and also it is having a connectivity through many of its own agents. That is the point of view. Okay. So how exactly all these things are going to work out? Personalized emailing. Yes, maybe people have observed uh, this point of view. And it's like uh, uh, when uh, the amount of a season will come for any of the particular product. Maybe I can go for naming it as such like uh, Deepavali, New Year, Yugadi is going to be one of the season for uh, buying uh, gold jewelries, vehicles, in a sense of automobile segment, correct? So, automatically mails will come. So, how all these things are going to be possible? How my email ID is being uh, um, available for them? That is the thing of the web transaction logs. Okay, so everywhere we are going to find it out uh, the point of view as like uh, people they are going to showcase their own accessibility and uh, they are going to hold the control over their email campaigning. The campaigning is almost such like convincing your customers through attractive ad page in the email itself. Okay, maybe the second point is about cookies. Cookies will come in a moment of time every moment. When you want to access through internet, maybe some of the cookies uh, have been uh, with uh, more paid or is highly paid cookies where that ads will never get closed for 10 seconds to 15 seconds. Correct? So, why all these things, how all these things will get happen? Assume that uh, you do have uh, one of the, the software that is an antivirus software which has been installed in your uh, uh, computer and cookies will come over there and also will show one of uh, uh, a small amount of uh, pictorial background with that uh, if you would like to avoid these cookies uh, you need to pay more the question will be there with you sir i have already paid some 500 rupees or 1000 rupees for this uh, for buying this antivirus and after that also why do I need to pay for this? Correct? So your question is always correct but that itself is one of the business phenomena, business platform for those antivirus selling people. That is how business runs. Correct? Maybe you have installed uh, one of uh, the uh, music application into your uh, mobile phone and uh, in between ads will come over there and uh, uh, you want to get fed up with that. And also some uh, two days or three days of the time, uh, um, one of the message will come to your mobile phone uh, 
it is going to say uh, such like uh, uh, you can go for using uh, uh, maybe music pro by paying uh, 999 only are you for listening to the music i have downloaded this app i was thinking that such like uh, it is free freely available and uh, why you need to pay 999 but people are there to pay that 999 also if they are going to feel happy with that particular app that is the truth concept okay so what exactly the market share for these amount of uh, email even uh, cookies what exactly the market share it's about 4 out of 1 lakh you cannot consider this is 1% also you are understanding the realization here okay so to 4 lakh sorry to 1 lakh people if you are going to share this cookies the conversion rate is only 4 so that is how the system runs in spite of that also where that is very negligible amount of uh, the expenditure what you going to make uh, for conversion of even for this 4 also because uh, assume that 999 multiplied by 4 nearly about 4000 you have earned correct but uh, for that 1 lakh uh, cookies for sending that 1 lakh cookies maybe you have paid hardly around uh, 200 rupees don't you think so that is a workful promotion expenditure yes that is a workful promotion expenditure that the people they are going to make use of all these aspects okay now you are understanding realizing the facts and figures associated with this and even about uh, web visitors sir how exactly web visitors uh, contacts can be found here yes in the uh, true reality every website whenever you going to visit you are going to visit that website either through any of your email id or else contact number so obviously that personal information always been attached with any of the website wherever you do access whether that's a application whether that's a software a website your personal details will be associated in one or the other sense okay so these contacts will be available for sales in the market maybe you people have uh, heard that uh, uh, facebook has faced a uh, penalty of so and so trillion or else billion amount of uh, penalty for sharing uh, the information of uh, users you heard that somewhere yes that's the point associated here okay so it is almost such like where all these data are going to be available for sale so what exactly these people will do for all these things is that to be called ethical hacking maybe that's also to be called as ethical hacking where you are going to concentrate you are going to focus on your routine work and when you want to visit to those, those kind of websites those websites are also the associated into your routine activities assume that uh, you would like to visit uh, some of uh, the grocery shop okay and during that time your uh, uh, mobile application concerned with uh, maps the identification of location is on that gps is on and when the gps is on 100% sure it is going to track that you are visiting to one of the provision store so immediately within a few seconds period of the time one of the cookie will get uh, uh, publicized in your mobile phone saying that uh, 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 we are from so and so company and uh, maybe all your groceries are available here in one platform maybe many of uh, things are available with the e-commerce activities so how all these things the surprising moments are going to take place yes the things are completely based upon tracked upon your artificial intelligence that big data analysis work will take place with the help of this uh, 
web transaction logins. The transactions is a, a sequence of a URL combined into one complete process. Yes, when you are going to uh, start working with uh, these URLs, for instance, uh, the websites when you are going to visit, those amount of combinations have been referred for your future prospect to and you will be considered as like one of the potential customer. So can we able to convert these customers? That's a question and answer is true. We can convince them very easily. When you want to understand their personal needs, desires, ambitions, actions, assume such like, uh, yes, uh, maybe with uh, uh, currently uh, where he is going to the provision store, there uh, he is getting uh, some of uh, the particular product uh, at so and so amount of price. And you will be showcasing it is with the 10% off here. Okay, so after showing the 10% off, the price is so similar. Okay, maybe he's paying somewhere around 100 rupees, and uh, you will be showing as such like uh, 110 rupees, and out of that 110 rupees, some 10% off. Ultimately, it is resulting into 99 rupees, correct? And you are also giving a free home delivery in the e commerce activity. He will feel so happy, such like uh, I need not to buy or else uh, carry that particular huge amount of uh, material bags to my home. Those groceries can be delivered online. So I need not to worry about further home. Correct? So things will go on a process as such like the expectations level are going to be double where if you want to deliver that satisfaction level will be so huge that's going to be a perfect sign okay so sir how exactly cookies uh, uh, are going to work out session cookies are there in the sense uh, when you are moving towards uh, one of the website and uh, aligned with that uh, one of the cookie will get showcased as such like uh, you can subscribe for so and so or else uh, you can go for uh, buying so and so correct so things will move on with the sessions wherever you do visit persistent cookies are there it's about a length of time where persistent cookies will come that is the, completely the payment is being made by those ad makers for those many number of seconds in spite of your efforts for closing that particular cookie also for that particular time, whichever it is being fixed till that time, that ad will not close and even you may not able to resume that also. Persistent cookies. I hope you understood how exactly it's going to run. Zombies. You have uh, uh, applied that close ad. In spite of that also, within 2 seconds, again it is going to showcase into the same replica. And also, it is going to be showcased as such like a continuation of that ad. That is to be considered as uh, zombies. Even about uh, secure. Codings will be given. The transmission is going to take place as uh, like your regional area. So, assume that uh, nearly around uh, some uh, 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 8 to 10 different languages are associated in uh, South India assumption. Okay. So, these 8 to 10 languages, wherever you want to visit to the, that based upon the location of that map, transmission is going to take place, that language. So, you feel so happy that you were watching the same ad in Kannada, you are in Karnataka and you want to reach to Andhra border, automatically it is going to get converted into Telugu. So surprising, but uh, it is true. It is going to be called as a, a secure cookies. It has been made for that only. Okay, HTTPs. HTTP cookies are uh, such like uh, you people are going to send that HTTP only directly. Application program interface completely where you are going to feel such like uh, this ad is irrelevant for me but they will make you that ad supposed to be relevant.
because uh, they will get to know through your accessibility after this particular app which app you would like to use because that's going to be a, one of the hobby for you maybe you will be using a mobile phone almost about uh, six months one year correct so that six months one year data it is made as such like artificial intelligence so they will read your memory they will read your habits as it is looking like you want to shift over or switch over to the next app this is only so https will get transmit from one application to another application that's also paid kind of nature but customized based upon the customer's interest individually same site into the same original website version of that particular website maybe cookies will come into the picture one or the other cookies you will close one cookie and automatically it will generate one more third parties so what exactly this difference between same site and third party same site in the same website when you are making the availability of the, those cookies the same website will be having the n number of connectivity with the different websites so wherever you will move on to the next website the last website where you left out no you closed that ad will get appear third party will be getting the same amount of premium position in some other sub website so why all these things are going to get happen is there any logic behind this yes true that itself is uh, there in your consumer behavior if you are going to repeat the same ad for eight different times into the restrictive time duration that can be able to be memorable in the mindset of your client that is memorable very easily okay even uh, super cookies are there top level domain of a search engine only it has been occupied completely so currently in india we are using google that's a top level search engine so when you want to open that search engine automatically those cookies will get uh, applied and uh, probably you may not able to close those cookies correct those super cookies maybe session cookies persistent cookies zoom base but super cookies are completely focusing over the origin wherever you would like to start commence your search from there itself all the cookies are going to get executed okay yeah so today we people have completed the uh, 14 marks quite important question thank you to everyone